I, I feed hay year round. I go through about 300 bales a year, and I have about 20 horses. There's, there's multiple ways you can actually use the nets and what we're going to do with you today is we're going to put the net around the whole entire bale, cinch it up and we'll set it inside the round bale feeder. So basically you're just going to throw the, the net over the top and you're going to get it as close to the back as you can um, and cinch it up somewhat so that when you get out to the um, to where the feeder is, it's not going to drag. If I'm by myself, that's what I do. I just will drive this or take and tuck up any extra, throw it up towards the top. Yep. Yep, yep. go ahead. Perfect. What we always tend to suggest with the feeders is if you have, a, uh, have horses that have shoes, what you're wanna, gonna wanna do is have your feeders flush to the ground so then that way that the net isn't going to come out underneath and somebody's going to hook a shoe. Look at how many horses already have learned to eat from it. It's been about a minute and a half. They, and what they're doing is they're realizing that the net is not what they want. And so they're taking it and they're grabbing the net and they're dropping it. And if you can see that horse right there in front of us, he's going, if you watch that, what they're realizing is to learn how to drop the net and keep the hay in their mouth. Same way that as they were out in the pasture, they're going to wiggle their lips, drop, a weed and keep the grass in the mouth. Is there any safety concerns I need to check to like the rope or if it's... You know, you know we always wow. tell you on a daily basis, check the, check the nets for safety. Just a common thing that you're going to do with your horses anytime. Um, if you see anywhere where there might have been a hole created or anything like that, what you're going to want to do is repair it as fast as you can so that that way they aren't going to get rewarded for any negative behavior. The hardest time they're going to be on these nets is in the first few days while they're learning. Um, it's going to be a whole new experience with eating, and what, but like what you're already seeing is they have to learn to think for their food now a little bit more, so they aren't going to spend as much time being aggressive towards each other. Uh, once you put these nets on, how much longer can I expect to see them about this? Well, we were in a study in 2010 at the University of Minnesota in which they compared 10 different feeders, uh, one of which was just a free choice bale. And what they found is that you're going to have 57% waste in a free choice bale. With our nets, you're going to get 94% out of every single bale with only 6% waste. Looking at it that way, if you're wasting, let's say you have five days on one bale, you should at least be able to extend it almost double. 